Hello and welcome to the Titus Timeout podcast. Today I'm going to answer the question, can I run my air handler with my series fan box off? So we get this question a lot. If a building has central heat available, it's not unusual to use this heat for a morning warm-up sequence. So you'd have the air handler producing heat and then blowing it into the space to heat up the system in the morning. Although it might seem simple to just leave the thermal unit fan off and drive their dampers wide open and then just let the air handler heat go straight into the space, it's not as simple as that. So let me draw a series fan box. So let's have the casing. We have the fan with a blower in it. The inlet here, and let me erase so the inlet can be open. And put an induced air inlet here and open up the discharge. So let's see what happens if I open the damper to full open but leave the fan off when I turn the air handler on for morning warm up. So now we have warm air coming out of the air handler and let's say it comes into the fan box here. This will cause the fan box to be under positive pressure. This will cause two things to happen. First, the air will want to follow the path of least resistance. Since the blower in the fan box creates a lot of resistance in this scenario because it's off, the air will want to go out the induced air inlet. Plus, the positively pressurized inside of the fan box will likely cause the blower to start rotating backward. So what you'll eventually end up with is a warm ceiling plenum, not a warm space, and a fan box blower that's rotating backward. But now what happens when you want to turn your series fan box motor on and go into normal operation? So when you energize the motor, the blower is already running backward and it will continue to rotate backwards. You'll get airflow from your fan box, but only about half as much as if it was rotating the correct direction. So let me get rid of all those heat lines and say we have cooling going into the space now. So you only get half as much airflow out of your fan, but the rest of the air has got to go somewhere. So you're going to have air going out the induced air inlet again. And this airflow isn't just air from the backward rotating fan, it's also going to be primary air which you paid to cool blowing into the box and out into the ceiling plenum. So you're going to get some amount of your cooling up in your ceiling plenum and say 50% of your cooling into your space. So for these reasons you should always energize the fan before switching on the air handler. So that answers the question about whether you can run your air handler without running your series fan boxes. I want to thank Randy Zimmerman, our chief engineer, for this topic this week. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, and thanks for taking the time out with us.